I participated in the study abroad program in Norway. Basically our two schools being partners, so then when we go there, we pay the same tuition that we would pay if we were going to Mayville. Luckily enough, they allow us to use our financial aid that we would have used here, which is amazing. It made it possible for me to go. Once you're there, you do have to go to school. But <laughs> at this school, we do a four day week, which is kind of nice because you have three days off, gives you a chance to travel places. The teachers are the best. They're very down to earth and understanding when you're gonna go travel. Professors are either from the United States or the degree that they have is from the United States and accepted by the United States Education Program. The credits you receive in Norway transfer. The places that Jeanette and I lived in were considered apartments to the Norwegians, but to us they were dorms. There's two people in one, one dorm. Um, the Americans can choose to have a Norwegian or an American roommate, and every American chose a Norwegian. My very best experience in Norway was being roomed with my roommate. We went on a couple of trips together. We went to Svalbard, actually on our flight there. We met two people from the Arctic Council, which kind of uh, regulate what happens in the Arctic. So that was really cool. He you know, told us a little bit what he does, and we were actually in a class that dealt on issues in the Arctic, and so we actually knew what he was talking about and could re relate to the subject. The last month I was in Norway, I was traveling like every weekend, and I went to London and Paris, Amsterdam. This experience changed me mostly because now I'm more confident in myself, I guess. I used to be really shy around people I didn't know, and I would never go up and talk to complete strangers ever, but now I'm like, oh, hi, how's it going? Like, it's no biggie anymore. <laughs> I'm not scared to go traveling anymore because before I'd be nervous about going to Fargo or the cities by myself and now I'm like, I can do it. It's no big problem. <laughs> In my future career as a teacher, I plan to integrate my uh, study abroad program. I want my students to be um, involved in a global society and now we have relations I have relations um, to people in Norway to you know people in Vietnam and to people you know all over the United States and I plan on integrating that into my um, teaching in every school there's going to be cultural differences and now that I've been in Norway and I've been part of the minority there I can help it can help me relate to my students who are not part of the majority population population so then I can help relate to them and be a more effective teacher. For those of you that are considering studying abroad I would say do it. Go for it. Um, I know sometimes finances becomes a burden and an issue but Mayville State University really tries to alleviate that. You can't put a price tag on the experience and the connections and the people you'll meet at the American College in Norway they're amazing and I just I would go.